is time for Quiz Corner, and it's time for my perfectly fitting hat. Thanks, cameraman Rick. See? Perfect. Fits my head. I've got such a small head, so it's a beautiful snug fit, everyone. Are you ready for Quiz Corner? Are you ready? You're going to get them all right again. Yep, he will. How many planets are there in Space Kids? Tiger Cubs. Tiger. Yeah. How many planets are there in space? Okay. You ready? Do it. Correct. Eight. Although some people say there's a ninth planet. There's a little bit of controversy about that. You can maybe look that up as well if you want to see who people think is the ninth planet or what the ninth planet is. But officially, according to NASA, which is a very important organization to do with space, they say there are eight planets. Well done, Tiger. Nice. When did man first land on the moon? When did man, humans, two men actually, first land on the moon? And again, we told you this earlier in the show. We hope you were listening, Tiger Cubs. Were you listening? Correct. July 20th, 1969. Well done. Is the sun a star or a planet? Is the sun a star or a planet? Tiger, what do you think? Because you'll get it. Correct. It is a star. Why can humans float in space? Float. Or like a bubble. Or like a cloud. Float. Why can humans float in space, Tiger? Tell them then. Correct. There's no gravity. Do you know what gravity is, kids? Tiger cups? Well, without Earth's gravity that we have on our Earth, we would fly right off into the air, into space. Well done, Tiger. As a reward for your 100% correct answers, what do you intend to do this time? He wants to send me off on a rocket. I've become a rocket man. Hi, Sir Elton. If you want it, then I'll do it. We're best friends and you always get them right, so that's your reward. Re. Two, one. Oh, Tiger, come on, send me back on this rocket. I don't want to be in space on my own. Please let me come back. Oh, Tiger, what a relief. You've brought me back to Earth. He made me disappear in episode one, kid. It would be a good idea to watch that episode. And now he's made me fly off on a rocket in episode two. I guess you deserve it for being so clever, but it's a bit scary. And also, I don't like being on my own. You know this. It's lonely. 